Here is a look at uh, inside a manhole. Um, this is a sewer, a sanitary sewer tap. So what's happening here is that uh, the pipe, the green pipe at the bottom there, is an existing 12 inch pipe. And we are tapping into that pipe by creating a base, what we call a dock house, um, putting it on top of that pipe and then finally cutting the pipe uh, the top part of the pipe, that's why it looks like um, it got cut off. Um, and we form the uh, cement around it in a slope so that uh, all the crap can actually go towards the middle. Um, and while the flow of the existing pipe is still flowing to the right direction, or the same direction. Here we're looking at the same manhole, um, except you're looking at the uh, source of the wastewater from the right. These are smaller two uh, inch pipes that is dumping poop or crap into the middle of the manhole. This is a view of the bottommost pipe uh, that is dumping into the flow of the existing uh, pipe. Here you can clearly see the channel uh, at the bottom where you see the water is ponding and then it's moving or supposed to be flowing to the middle and connect, connecting and flowing uh, kind of like in an angle, uh, not quite 45 degree, but uh, that's what we're trying to do is, is make it flow towards the same direction as the existing pipe is flowing. Uh, there's two pipes here that is dumping poop or crap, whatever you want to call it, into the uh, main pipe at the bottom, and you can see there is a inflection, or no, no, deflection at the concrete, is concaved in to create a channel uh, to guide the waste material uh, into the existing pipe. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel to see more do-it-yourself videos like these, and support my channel. Thank you.